Doors locked to walk in public at the Billie Jean King Main Library in Long Beach, where staff telling patrons service where you call ahead and they hand your stuff over at the door. We've had to temporarily close the library to in-person visits to protect both patrons and our city employees. There are a lot of mentally ill who take up residency here during the day. I've been attacked three times upstairs. In the library? Yes. I had one man throw things at me. I had another man spit on me one day. The library remains largely surrounded by a chain link fence that went up last year to prevent illegal camping while Civic Center construction was going on. But at least people could go in, and yes, that included homeless, who called the safety concerns. Yeah, but I think it's a lie. It's wrong, though, to have any stories of general or how they come up with that stuff. Long Beach police confirmed there have been issues, but they say staffing does not allow them to have full-time security either at this library or any of the others in the city that have also gone to pick up only. Right now, we're all of our library system is challenged with the same issue. We're asking our librarians to frankly do things that are way beyond the scope of their jobs as librarians. The closest libraries to us that are open is Mark Twain. Okay. The scope of the job now includes directing would-be visitors to other facilities. It's our first time here. We've driven by plenty of times, so we wanted to give it a try. And yeah. They came from Compton. This mom trying to explain to her daughter why they couldn't go in just moved to Long Beach. Just bought a house. I am raising a small child. Super disappointing. It's a free public space. We expect it to be open and available for homeless or not homeless. In Long Beach, I'm Christina Gonzalez, Fox 11 News.